guys, it's Artalissa coming at you with a video in my car on the way to work. And um, I don't really have like a prolific, long video. This is more a reminder for anybody who's going through a really rough time, anybody who's going and is in the thick of their healing journey, uh, you know, isn't has to have, maybe doesn't have clarity on, on where to go next with your path. You know, maybe things are falling down all around you and you just don't know how to get your grip back. Whatever's happening, right? Whatever's happening, whatever you're moving towards, whatever you're trying to accomplish, whatever you're trying to do that's uh, good for yourself or, or beneficial for you and your family, whatever you are moving towards for your body, for your health, anything, right? It could be anything. Guys, this is your reminder to just stay the course stay the course, no matter how hard it gets. Even if you feel like you don't see the results, results take time, depending on what you're trying to do. Are you trying to build an empire? Are you trying to build a career? Are you trying to, you know, are you trying to make changes that take time? Uh, it's about being gentle with yourself through the process. And if you're not accomplishing what you feel like you're accomplishing, uh, immediately take a look at that. Why do you feel like it has to happen uh, in a grandeur, uh, super instant gratification manner? Or uh, why does it have to happen so quickly? Is it because, you know, uh, look at the circumstances surrounded by that. And then as you look at what's pushing you to want to give up or to not keep going or, um, sorry, that sun came in. I just happened to look at the, anyways, <laughs> it, it distracted me. There's my little, and there's my ADHD and autistic brain just kind of, uh, anyways, but look, whatever's distracting you, whatever's making you feel like you don't have what it takes to keep forward, whatever it is, right? It's showing you something. It's showing something you need to look at, right? It's showing something. It's not saying give up, right? It's not saying that. It's not, it's not, it, it's pushing, the, putting things, or put, things, blah, 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 blah. things uh, and people and places and situations put pressure on us uh, to move, to flow, to get out of our comfort zone so that we can see something that we're not seeing because we are in our comfort zone. Isn't that, isn't that the kicker? It's like, man, I want to be comfortable, right? In this world, in this society, we're all working towards peace and comfort, not having to work, not having to do all of these things that just take us away from, uh, you know, the other things that we're trying to do in our life. And it's just kind of like an uphill battle sometimes. But the truth is, is that we can have peace and joy and all the things that we want uh, without having to hustle to get them. It's in us already. Uh, we have the capability to give us peace, to give us clarity, even though sometimes it doesn't come as easy as we need or we want or we demand, right? So guys, just keep going. I'll tell you what, I was at a place in my journey, um, Know, within the last couple, couple weeks ago, maybe a little bit sooner, maybe a week ago, last week actually, and it was really, really dark and dark and heavy, and I, ha I don't even know if I've um, had that deep, dark of a space I have really sat in and really looked at what it's teaching me, but it happens. Uh, even when you think you've moved through something, you know, there's always going to be something else that you have to... Um, process and do. And I tell you what, I was questioning whether I'm doing the right thing. Am I doing the right thing? Am I putting content out there that people want to hear? Am I, am I, uh, am I reaching people? Am I helping people? Uh, you know, if, if I just, if sometimes we feel like our materialistic success is showing us that we're not successful. But as I started to doubt myself, which we always do, we got to pull ourselves out of it. I had a lot of people uh, in that time that I really believe were called to tell me how uh, important my talks were or, uh, you know, things that I've done to help them and people I didn't even know watch my videos, you know, and, and it really just showed me that it doesn't, you don't have to see the results just yet. Sometimes it's about staying the course and believing that you will reach that and, and, and testing you to see how vigilant you are in the process to accomplish whatever it is you do. And once I really started to surrender, to that notion and take what people have told me and and really say you know what I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing because if I help one person then I'm doing I'm successful right help one person and you're successful and, and and in this day and age it's like oh we have to help millions of people in order to be successful and that's just not it because every one person that we help uh, their vibration expands their frequency expands and they step into their true power and when they do they urge their energy pushes other people to do it so 
that's where I am at and I'm pushing through and the things are starting to happen. There's people that are showing up for me I didn't expect would show up for me without asking. There's just a lot of things that are happening. So I've learned to stay the course. If you know it in your heart, you feel it. You're like, I know I'm supposed to be doing this. I know I just got to find a way. I just have to stay the course and it's going to happen. Things are going to show up on your path to help guide you and to give you the clarity and the confirmation that you need. So guys, no matter how deep and dark and rough it gets, stay the course. Stay it, stay it, stay it, stay it. I urge you, stay that dang old course. All right, guys, I'm getting on the freeway, and this thing is super bumpy. Yo, Y'all who are local, 225 ain't no joke, guys. And I, uh, I do admit I probably need to get my, my shocks checked in my car. So, anyways, before it gets too crazy and I get into a lot of traffic, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and cut it off. Y'all have a good day, guys. I hope this message found who it's meant to at the time. I believe it will. I believe it will. I believe it. I believe it. And I know that, yeah, that's all I got to say. <laughs> all right, guys. Bye.